Hey guys, this is Toxic. Um, welcome to my tutorial for USB webcam for uh, Android phones. In this tutorial, I'm going to be going over a new application that I found because Placaware decided to stop supporting its uh, USB webcam application, which is really sad because I was really excited. But this one is um, made by Wireless Orange. It's the W O or WO webcam light. There's also a paid version of this webcam. The distinct difference between the two is that the light version only supports low resolution. So if you're one of those people who care about the quality of your video and your phone can take better um, video recording, then this is the one for you. It's $1.99 in the Google Play Marketplace. Um, with this webcam, which I like, you can connect it over Bluetooth, USB, or Wi-Fi, and it can also stream for messengers for uh, such as Skype, MSN Live, Gtalk, Yahoo, and uh, a couple other ones. I know TinyCam works, and uh, ManyCam works as well. So, what we're going to do first is we're going to download the USB drivers for our Android device. I use the Motorola Droid X. Um, that's what I'm actually using for this tutorial today. And you can find, for anyone who's using a Motorola device, you can just go to the USB drivers and download the Motorola Device Manager. And this will actually, it will automatically install all of the different Android or USB drivers that are made for your phone. Depending on the connectivity that you want, um, you can set your phone in USB debugging mode, which I have these steps for you. Um, you're going to go to your Applications tab on your phone, Settings, um, go to Applications, Development, and then you're going to check the USB debugging mode. When the um, USB debugging is checked, for Motorola phones at least, and you actually plug in your device, it will um, connect as a ADB debugging or ADB composite device. You're going to go to My Computer, uh, Properties, Device Manager, in order to double check the interface connection but if you did download all of these do all of these steps correctly and restart your computer when the next time you plug in your um, Android phone to your computer and turn on PC mode it should come up as an ADB interface once you have the application downloaded on your phone you also want to download the client which I'm going to show you right now you're going to go to their website, which is sites.google.com slash site. Yeah, I'm just going to leave that in the description box for you. Um, you're going to go to um, downloads, and you're going to select the client, setup program version 2, 2.11. And this will give you the icon on your desktop. Once you have both of these in place, you're going to go to the application on your phone, hit the activate button to the left of the screen, and then you're going to double click on the icon on your desktop, and you're going to hit connection, connect, USB, select USB, and hit OK. The screen should blink pretty quickly here, and that means that the device is connected with the client and server. Next, you're going to go into Skype, which that's what I'm using just for the sake of this video. Um, you're going to go into your audio and video settings and select the WO webcam. Once that is selected, you can, you can tell that the application is running perfectly. Um, it's running smoothly. It's a lot faster than the old client that I was using before with the USB uh, tutorial from last time, but I like it so far because the orientation of the camera is completely um, 
it's completely right side up. You're not gonna have to mess with like tiny cam or mani cam in order to get it to work. Um, you can actually flip the view horizontally or vertically, um, depending on the orientation of the camera on your uh, actual phone. But that's just about it. So if you have any questions, just leave them below. I'm going to leave all the links for all the downloads um, below in the description box. Please subscribe to Toxic Tech Tips if you would like to see more of these videos. And yeah, that's about it. Um, thanks for watching and have a nice day.